this beautiful wonderful lady she just recently gave her life to Jesus Christ and got water baptized so we want to hear from you Kimberly um, who invited you to Hungry Jen and how did you receive Jesus Christ let's face the people so I got invited by my friend Priscilla um, she was texting me like to come she was inviting me to her baptize and I would make so much excuses to not come to church and um, I was like she's like she invited me to um, Wednesday service so youth group and I was like um, I was like yeah I'll go I came and it was it was a feeling that I never felt before because I'm not I haven't been to church like my family doesn't really go to church a lot so um, this was a new experience for me and so what was the life before you received Jesus Christ and what are the changes that you see now after giving your life to Jesus so changes that I have noticed is like um, when I would have problems I would just like be like why is this happening to me like you know I wouldn't pray to God now I get myself like I'm driving or I'm at work and I get myself like praying you know like and it's now it's constantly in my life that is amazing let's put our hands together for Jesus Christ and we're so happy and I want to notice uh, I mean something that she said that her friend invited her and this is so important to step out of a comfort zone and push the embarrassment fears aside and actually invite people because if you and I we don't invite people that we work with or we hang out go to gym with they will not come many people they actually want to come but just because we're not stepping out they have they, they feel awkward so I'm gonna encourage every single person here um, we all have people around us like Kimberly our friends and co-workers and we have in a couple of weeks our Easter service coming up I'm gonna ask you to step out this time and bring someone with you because they want to receive Jesus Christ some of them they just don't know about it yet and God is so amazing he loves people and he wants to give them salvation and change their lives break addictions and things like that okay and so Kimberly I know if you can pull up the picture where she's she got baptized that's her yep come on let's put our hands together for Kimberly she took that step we congratulate you for giving your life to Jesus Christ and getting water baptized which is next step if you have given your life to Jesus Christ and you have not been water baptized yet the next step is to get water baptized and so we congratulate you on that and can you please share a word of advice to people who might be uh, they want to give their life to Jesus Christ but they feel awkward or what should they do I tell you not to double think think it because I was double thinking it a lot and it was not actually it's not that bad so you guys should definitely do it <laughs> Thank you, Kimberly. Thank you. Come on, let's put our hands together one more time. Watching this content, I hope this was a blessing to you. If you're like me and you like to click on things, click on this, subscribe to our channel, and the content will come to you every time we post it. And remember, the best is yet to come.